for all you Bud Light queer hating motherfuckers. Sissy ass bitches. Well, that's Bud Light's new customer base. Ain't gonna recover the six billion dollar shortfall, man. Absolutely. You want to show your community as a positive beacon of light, and you just made yourself look like a bunch of chavs. Well done, loves. Absolutely won't touch a single one of you with a barge pole. Get me my barge pole out. Get that barge pole and extend it full whack, man. No way. Won't touch a single one of them, man. Absolutely ridiculous. Right. Chavy, not classy. And let me tell you now, my niece and nephews, American, middle American market is huge. Their little market is, look, we're going to be the new Bud Light drinkers. Oh yeah, look at us. We're gay and proud. And we're going to support Dylan Mulaney. God, do you support Dylan Mulaney? But I'll tell you now, you ain't, you ain't going to recover $6 billion for Budweiser. So, again, you, what you're trying to say and do is invalid. There's no one, no one is saying you can't be gay, you can't be proud. No one is saying you can't be transgender. You know, no one, no one has said that. No one has said you cannot do, be what you want to be. But if you're going to do national commercials and a company is going to do something that's going to annoy its customer base or do something that's controversial to some people's beliefs, then there is going to be a reaction and a backlash. And again, to this, I'm pretty certain there's going to be a reaction and a backlash to this video. As Uncle Jason says, the proof is in the pudding. And the pudding will be the share price and the value of the company and how much money they're going to make or lose from this. Because at the end of the day, I don't know how much we hate it or how much we love it. We live in a capitalist world and it's all about money, money, money. It's so funny in a rich person's world. Money, money, money. Must be funny in a rich person's world. See, Uncle Jason being inclusive. Being inclusive to them. But it's like, I'm, I'm, having, I'm having a bit of a laugh and a joke here, but seriously though, I think they're confusing being gay and being trans and dressing like a drag queen is the same thing as well. Like, somebody who's gay and knows who they are and they're proud of being gay is one thing. Being transgender and don't know if you're Arthur or Martha born bomb by May and Morecambe Bay, that's a complete different kettle of fish. So, I don't get it. I really don't. As always, my nieces and nephews, thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.